If you were here by Sophia Hazlett, if you were here today and I could take your hand in mine and look into your eyes and say, forgive me, dear, I know that heart of mine would all respond too gladly. The words I may have said had shaken your brave spirit sadly, your hand would rest upon my head in naught but earnest kindness. Your gentle voice and dainty treat would waft away my blindness, and I would not have mourned thee dead. I gaze into your sad, sweet eyes in pictured form, and wonder how chasms yawn, and walls arise twixt woes so naught should sunder. Strange, when friends are few and purest love a dainty rare, will not prove true, that with a fixed and vacant stare we look away in cold pretense. It is all right, we do not care, when every heart beat, hot and tense, denies the charge laid bare. Grim paper walls of sternest doubt, willful we misunderstood, and yet the enemy to road may simply need my wave of hand. A sunny smile, a little thing, a power, a perfect talisman to ward away as birds of wing the noisome vapors of earth's ban. Our oh, when memory bears set pallid lips, and waxen hands lie limp and low beneath a sodden mound, where sips remorse, who dines at courts of woe, and gluts himself on misery if we had only known. But tis not given us here to see till later days have flown, and yet we know, as now we must, your dear, dear hands, if you could speak, would clasp your hands in perfect trust, and whisper with white lips and meek, I do forgive as he forgives. Believing this, for heart is sore, we courage take, for still there lives the sentiment feeling hour and hour. But you are here in spirit, your hand takes mine the same old way. I feel your heart beat near it, I look into your eyes and say, Father, mother, brother, child, whoever it may be, let thy presence, true and mild, stay near to whisper me, lest I regret again and time bring back to me the same old mournful strain to linger through eternity.' 